They keep you in the mindset where you limited, then they fucking win. You stay in the open mindset, you always know that you that bad motherfucker, you always moving forward towards something, you always are a visionary. You see shit happening here before it ever plays out in the motherfucking... Man. You are powerful beyond measure. I was just sitting here sun gazing, right? And as I'm sun gazing, I see shit come across the sun. And it's like, but it starts to clear up. So I'm like, is everything that we're looking at, is it just, is it just like a fog? But what you're trying to look at is the mirror so you can see yourself and everything else is a fog trying to distract you from what is truly real. Like they try to throw shit in your face. They want you to be reliant on materialistic shit. They want you to be addicted to things that are not for you. They want you to be distracted. They throw pussy in your face. And ladies, they try to make you as promiscuous as you can be. And then they try to give you to give your, all your energy away to everybody that's outside of you. When it is poor spiritual health to allow everybody to have access to you. And that's not just for the ladies. That's for the men as well. And I know I'm about to come at you with a whole bunch of different motherfucking things. But when you feel something on your mind, you feel something on your heart, you feel something in your soul, then you got to fucking let it be. The key is to stay free and to always do what you love to do or always to do what you believe in and come at whatever it is that you want to come at with no limitations placed upon yourself and limitations are only placed in the mental. They're not placed outside of you. They're not placed and opportunities or this or that or experiences no they're placed inside of your mind from whatever it is that you came across that made you start believing in that fuck shit you need to let that go because a limitation is gonna stay a limitation until you break that motherfucking chain until you let that shit go and so i was wondering what the fuck is really real what are we looking at? What is true? What is here for us? Because they say, man, not even they say, look, I'm going to come at you like this. The real shit. <laughs> the real shit, man. You finding yourself. You getting in the right mindset. What is here for me that will allow me to do that? I could go out in nature and put my motherfucking feet in the grass and ground myself, center myself, clear my mind. I could come out here and sun gaze and start to open my third eye, my pineal gland, so I can see everything for what it is. I can see opportunities. I can see people that are not for me in life, but are acting like they are for me and cut the motherfuckers off. I can move on from this and this and this because I have that power and we all have that gift and that light within us. Not one person is lacking in that area. Nobody comes to this life and desires a poor life. And when I say poor, I'm not talking about financially. A poor life, look, there's a difference between being poor and there's a difference between being broke. Broke is temporary, poor is forever. You are living a poor life, then stop living a poor fucking life. Change your motherfucking mindset. You know exactly what that takes. You know exactly what that looks like. You know what you can do today. It ain't gotta, you ain't gotta go to sleep to start a new motherfucking day. That shit can start right here, right now. What are you going to do now? You have that opportunity. People be like, are you just human? And that is only applied to certain cases. People can, people can continuously use the excuse, oh, we're just human, oh, we're just learning, oh, I'm just living my life. That's bullshit. That's fucking bullshit. Because when you know what is right, and then you choosing what is wrong, that is on you. That's not, all oh, we just human. That's not, oh, I'm just learning. Oh, I'm just living my life. You're a fucking idiot. And I'm not coming at nobody, demeaning nobody, belittling nobody. I just want everybody to live the life that is here for them. You could get to that life just by simply changing your mental, by developing such a fortitude of your mind. And this is lady and gentle motherfucking men. You could change your life. Men, love what you do in life. Love your fucking purpose in life. Love is not a thing that makes you look like a pussy or makes you look like this or look like that. And ladies, don't be the pretty girl with no purpose.
Don't just be pretty. Be great. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Now is your motherfucking time. Believe in yourself. And a lot of things can come around you to try to center you. A lot of things can happen every single day. Signs. This happening, this happening, this happening. Just so you can stay on top of your game. Just so you can be focused. Just so you can see where your focus is. What am I doing? If you ask yourself that. And then you have a bunch of clear answers. Then you know what you're doing. Cool. But if you ask yourself, what am I doing? And you got nothing to say. Find something to say. Make sure that next time you ask yourself that question, it's going to be filled with. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now is your time. I say that every motherfucking day because we're never living in the past. We're never living in the motherfucking future. Always live in the now. The future never comes. The past is always in the past. We're always in the now. Do you want the now to become the past and you're never living in the now because you're always focused on the past or you're always focused on the future? That's where fear comes from. Fear always comes from what's going to happen, what might happen. Your mind making up a whole bunch of motherfucking scenarios of shit that probably is never going to happen. Nine times out of ten, it doesn't. You're going to ask that girl out that you like so much. Then you're like, oh, what if she says this? What if her friends start laughing? What if this? What if that? What if this? What if that? Ladies, you got to get on the motherfucking cheerleading team. Ladies, you got to go for that run. Then you're like, oh, I wonder how I look in this outfit to that person when I run by their house. I wonder this. Oh, my family. My family ain't been on that exercise front. I wonder what they gonna say when I start. Fuck all that. Fuck all that! Now is your motherfucking time. Believe in yourself. Stop setting limitations upon yourself. Because when you set limitations upon yourself, everything that made you set that wins. Because it usually comes from outside sources. We are not born into this world thinking, I don't want to be successful. I don't want to win. I, I just want... I'm not even going to say it because I, no, 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 no. You don't come into this world thinking like that. You are taught that shit. Who is your teacher? Yeah, your teacher may be given to you at the beginning, but as you grow into life, you can start to choose who they are. I want, I want to get around that person because they doing something that I fuck with, that I want to learn about, that I want to get more experience in. Cool. Come teach me something. You ain't above me. You just teaching me. I'm learning. I got something to learn. I'm ignorant in that area. I don't know nothing in that area. So teach me. Let's learn. And then whenever I learn, let's get this motherfucking. <clears throat> you can and you will. There is no excuses. What is real in life? What is really real? Are these cars passing by real? Is that lake that's down the motherfucking street real? How would I know unless I jump in that motherfucker? It's them questions about life. It just makes you wonder. None of these cars going by distracts me because I am purpose driven. I know what I'm doing and what the fuck I want. I even wrote that shit down earlier. What do you want to be an inspirational speaker, to help my family, to be conscious, To have that knowledge up top, to be able to pass it on and to stay free because we already are free. And if you feel like you're not free, that is a mental limitation you are setting upon yourself because you can do it right here, right now. If there's a will, there's a motherfucking way. I promise you. Can't be stopped. You won't be stopped. Look at yourself in the mirror and say, ooh, you bad motherfucker. Yeah.